Welcome to Apartment Cooking, where we make meals for small households in small kitchens. When I ask people, do you like cooking? Sometimes they'll say, I only know how to boil water. But if you know how to boil water, that's already a starting point for making decent meals. I'll show you what I mean. If you can boil water, then you can cook eggs. You can poach them, soft boil them, hard boil them. And then you can have meals like egg salads and egg sandwiches and so on. All from knowing how to boil eggs. Another thing you can cook in boiling water is a noodle soup. Don't just grab a pack of instant noodles and leave it at that. There are a variety of pastas and noodles out there. So experiment! Also experiment with your soup flavors. Aside from the reliable soup stocks, why not try a miso paste? or a laksa paste. Your local store might also have a chili oil or a sesame oil. These will give a new spin to your noodles. One of my friend's moms actually used Vegemite, which is a yeast extract, as a soup stock. I've never tried using it myself, but if you have, please let me know in the comments below. I also like to add vegetables to my noodle soups for extra nutrition. Fresh or frozen vegetables both work great. And here we are, a tasty noodle soup with vegetables. You can throw in a boiled egg in there as well because you know how to boil eggs. <laughs> boiled water means that you can steam food. I'm using a metal steamer, but bamboo ones work just as well. Here I've got some fish, carrots, and cauliflower, but you can also steam chicken, tofu, corn, green beans, the list goes on. And there you have it, some quite decent meals you can make at home steamed fish and vegetables, a hearty noodle soup, and some eggs for breakfast or salads. All thanks to the magic of boiling water. This has been Apartment Cooking. Thank you for watching.